Kyo's Tokyo Travels Day 2. I traveled to Ghibli Museum without entering. After a hectic first day, it's time for a journey. An escape into a world that exists only in your imagination. Surely I jest, or do I? Not gonna lie. Getting your hands on those tickets to see sculptures of your favorite cat bus or stepping. Then expecting a good price for a plane ticket to Japan during spring. You guessed it right. I was one of the majority who didn't click fast enough to get them. But I wanted to go there regardless. Located in Inokashira Park in Mataka, Tokyo, Ghibli Museum sits quietly hidden behind tall trees and bushes away from prying eyes. One glance at the sheer amount of humans queuing to get in and the permanently closed ticket counter served by a Totoro figure, you know for sure this place is going to pack with magical surprises although I cannot vouch for any of them. The reason why I specifically traveled to the outskirts of town was to absorb more of local flavors and the humble neighborhood it has to offer. An elderly man playing the flute carefreely, a few people quietly appreciating the quiet beauty of nature as the cool breeze swept, that's how I wanted my Thursday to be. If you share a similar, craziness, or passion as me, take the JR Cho line. To JR Mataka Station, approximately 20 minutes from JR Shinjuku Station. From the south exit of JR Mataka Station, it's a 15-minute walk to the museum, or you can, of course, hop onto the Ghibli bus like I did. Let's continue on the next segment, stay tuned.